I haven't uploaded videos in around six months and everyone's been asking what have I been doing, so I'm here to catch you up. Hello my friends, welcome back to Late Departure, I'm Adam and as some of you may know this is my continuing journey to hopefully becoming an airline pilot sometime in the future here. Always working more and more towards this dream, it's been a long hard journey, I'm getting close to the end now, it's been really fun, a lot of really cool things as you can see here. I've flown back today to the Beau Séjour fly-in diner thing, just came down and landed on the lovely grass strip down here. And it's a gorgeous day, and I know it's been a long time since I've been doing any of these videos because, honestly, for me, the channel, it's something that, you know, I was really happy to do. I still am happy to do because it lets me share some of the things I've learned with people and hopefully help other people out there who are trying to become pilots, uh, people who are like me, maybe, like uh, maybe slightly older uh, flight students who you know, just wanted to try flying and thought it would be a really fun journey. And I definitely did. And it's brought me here today. I came here today as a flight instructor, which is interesting. That's a different role to be in. But uh, that brings me to, I guess, what have I been up to for the past, I don't know, six months since I posted a video. And uh, well, <laughs> I've been flight instructing. And really for me, like doing this, like doing my study and doing my job and getting to my goal here is really the top priority and it's a little bit higher priority than the YouTube channel of course. Uh, that being said, the YouTube channel is something I want to keep doing. I want to keep, you know, keeping you guys posted on what I've done, the handy kind of tips and tricks that have helped me kind of get to where I am, uh, things that hopefully can help other people in the same position. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I just have been studying really hard and I've been getting through my exams and, you know, I'm even now, studying for just the next exam and the next exam. There's always something else to study for, but you know, I'm just working hard. I've already been flying as a flight instructor for many, many hundreds of hours now. And so, yeah, things have just gone by in a flash. I'm already out here. I was teaching uh, the air cadets again this year, which is nice. And yeah, it's just been really, really fun. But yeah, in terms of what I've been doing, I've been doing this and really that's the priority. I think for anyone, you just got to realize the priority is achieving your goals, doing whatever you can to do that, whether that be out here flying the Piper or whatever it is, flight instructing, uh, just getting what you need to get done. And I can't emphasize enough. I know a lot of people, they kind of see what I do and they're like, oh yeah, like I'll just come out and I'll get my flight licenses and I'll do all this kind of stuff. It is really hard. It's hard and it's challenging, but it is really fun and rewarding as well. And you know, as long as you remember that and if you're really in it to win it and you really want to do this, then it's definitely something you can do. But that's what I've been up to. Uh, next time you see me, I might have cut my hair here because I'm actually be cutting my hair pretty soon. My hair has just been, it's something that I did as a COVID project. I just wanted to see what it was like to have long hair. It's been fun. I've, I've enjoyed it. It looks better wet. It looks kind of terrible right now. But, you know, I'm probably going to be cutting that because at some point I'll be applying for jobs here and I need to look a little bit more professional and all that kind of stuff. Not to say that, you know, long hair is a professional. I'm sure that there are ways I could tie it nicely and do something that would make it work. But uh, to be honest, I just prefer having shorter hair. It's a little easier to deal with. But it was a lot of fun and it was kind of a cool thing to do for a little while there. But that's pretty much it. I hope all of you are, are having a really great time. You're enjoying your day. I hope if you're out flying, you're like this on a beautiful day like today, going out and flying and having fun and uh, you know, meeting new friends and new contacts and just having an amazing time because that's really what this is all about, right? And as soon as I can, I have a, a few videos I'm gonna update. I have a video on the Manitoba conference with some really great advice I got from some pilots there. And I'll be updating you on some other things. I have a whole bunch of, of resources and stuff like that that I've been amassing throughout all my training and all of my work here. Uh, that I want to share with everyone as well in terms of, you know, the resources that I've used for drawing on maps and even like a headphone comparison because I know uh, a lot of people for headsets for, for aviation, uh, there was research done a while back that I was referring to when I was buying headsets. That's something I also want to share with everyone. There's a whole bunch of stuff to talk about, but uh, as always, I'm always so happy to have all of you along for the journey. I'm on the Discord every once in a while. But uh, yeah, ultimately, just I hope you're out, you're flying, having fun, staying safe. And uh, well, as I keep pushing forward, I, everything is moving. All the pieces are moving and I'm just jumping forward faster and faster through this, uh, this career here. So 
I'm enjoying it while I do it, but that being said, uh, you know, things are looking pretty good. I'm very happy about that and my hard work is paying off and it's just showing that, you know, it's never too late. So see you next time.